Hello once again ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to NRK. Today I'm playing Plague Inc. Evolved again. It's been a very long time since I've played this uh, on this channel. I've played a little bit in my uh, personal time, but on this channel not so much. Um, since Versus Multiplayer came out, I haven't actually played this game very much. And uh, for this video I just wanted to have a quick little game and uh, chat as well. Uh, I was going to do a custom scenario, but I scrolled through a lot of them and I, I didn't really see one that really took my fancy. I'm going to do Simeon Flu because I actually haven't done this one in a really, really long time. Um, and honestly don't remember a lot of it. So, I'm only going to do it on normal because I've heard that this game has gotten a lot more difficult since the update and released out of early access. So I'm not going to, I'm going to call this... Barry. Okay. So yeah, it's been a real, really long time since I've uh, uploaded any plague videos, and I do apologize for that. Uh, for the people who thoroughly enjoy me playing this game, um, the main reason I haven't been playing it is because uh, I kind of played it to death. I feel, and I didn't think a lot of people were enjoying it anymore. That's kind of the main reason I stopped playing it, uh, along with the fact that. Um, with versus and co-op, oh shit! Uh, with versus and co-op, the game changed quite a lot when it moved to multiplayer, and it was kind of starting to annoy me a little. Uh, a couple of the changes, a lot of the changes still do annoy me, but <laughs> what am I gonna do? I don't know. I haven't played this in a while, so if I do something drastically wrong, don't don't freak out. <laughs> I know that pretty much any time you get a symptom now, it's confirmed that your disease is fucked. Like, the stealth strategy is... I've played a couple of matches online uh, with multiplayer, and i found that the stealth strategy doesn't really work anymore. Uh, yeah, I don't really know where I'm going with this conversation, I apologise. The stealth strategy doesn't work because um, whenever you get a symptom and you've infected too many people, like that, before you can even react, uh, you have begun getting cured, my friend. I don't really remember my, my strategy for Simeon Flu because it's been probably about a year since this this plague came out. <laughs> and I haven't touched it since because it, uh, it's honestly not one of my favourites. I have played Necro uh, before. Like, recently, as in, I know everyone knows I've played Necrol before, because I copped a lot of shit because apparently I wasn't playing it on Mega Brutal. Um, apes and just give me a second. Apes and improve their understanding of human behaviors, reducing the likelihood of being detected. Okay, that's fine. Um, what I mean by that is, uh, every now and then I get a comment on my really, really old Mega Brutal uh, Plague Inc. Necrol virus video with, of someone saying this isn't Mega Brutal, because when they updated it, um, they made it so much harder, like near impossible levels of difficulty, and everyone thinks that that tutorial's a load of shit. <laughs> it's not really a tutorial, it's just me playing the game. Which is fair enough, because it's not the same, uh, but at the same time, they really need to check the date of the video. And I think, I just find it ironic because the first like five minutes of the video is me literally clicking on the Mega Brutal thing and clicking play and there is no cuts in between at all. So I, I find that a bit funny. I don't know why this turned into a little bit of a rant, but anyway. Intelligent ape colony, uh, uh, blah, blah, blah. intelligent apes form a colony in Central Af Africa. It'd be really great if I could learn English. Um... I've also noticed that a lot of these symptoms are super expensive to devolve. Like, 25 DNA points to devolve. How much are they to buy? Four. One. Are you kidding? <laughs> so pretty much if a symptom evolves, fuck me, right? Alright, so I guess we need to get the... I know there's an ability or something to get more DNA points from... Uh, DNA generate from colonies. There we go. More DNA gen uh, points from colonies is what I was going to say. So we've fully infected Central Africa's apes. So pretty much what we need to do at the moment is spread the apes, if I remember correctly, and uh, make the apes 
pretty much superior to the humans in every way. And then turn on them. Or, you know... Ooh, I'm so sorry about that. Uh, enhanced communication between apes allows complex stru uh, social structures to develop colonies, increase ape transmission. That's pretty good. Yeah, let us... This stuff's cheap, but to devolve symptoms and stuff is going to cost me half of my life. Which is crazy. Rash mutates. Which is crazy because it's going to... It's going to... It's going to really hurt. It's going to hurt when they, uh... They decide it's okay to kill me. Give me the green light for death. My humans are spreading, which is not great. That's not what I want at all. I want the humans just to be like... I want them to be okay with being sick. Alright, let's upgrade their feces. 10 DNA points to upgrade poo. Uh, world apes are pretty pretty good. Okay, we got, we got upgraded poo now. So we should be good. I don't understand how most of the world is infected with apes when I haven't left this area. Fever has mutated. Doesn't that kill people? Oh, it can be fatal. Oh, it can be. 25 DNA points to devolve, of course. <laughs> Give me more DNA points, please. Thank you very much. Jesus. Alright. Uh, what's this one? Blood gift. Virus replicates in ape bloodstream and can be spread if blood is mixed. Increases ape to ape transmission. I don't think I need any more ape to ape transmission. I need to move them. Which is this one. So, forgive me if I'm doing extremely terribly at this, which I can pretty much assure you at the moment I am. Uh, I haven't done this in a very long time. Uh, understanding of logistics lets uh, large groups of apes travel rapidly and efficiently over large places. Kinky winky. I'm gonna move this colony to Brazil. Uh, so where are we? Pretty much... Oh, that's why. Okay. I, I, I said a stupid thing. Uh, what I said was, I don't understand how most of the population can be infected when we're pretty much only in Africa and near Russia and that. But the reason is because it's ape population, not human population. I'm a dumb, and I apologize for that. Uh, let's get a little bit more sneaky sneak. Okay, what else can I talk about with you lovely people? Uh, I'm very happy that the Mortal Kombat video that I did with Taylor... Uh, was well received by you people. What does that mean, Liam? You people. Received by you guys. Is that better? I apologize. I'm terrible with words. All the time. Not even half the time. All of it. I'm very happy that you guys enjoyed it. Um, I think we're going to be doing Freddy and Leather. Uh, Freddy versus Le Ah! I cannot talk today. I'm so sorry. Freddy? But Freddy isn't even in it. Jason versus Leatherface. This is just a mess. This is a mess of video. I should scrap the recording and try speaking again, but then, then again, it's just going to be even worse. So why the hell not? Um, yeah, we're going to do Jason versus Leatherface, and I think Taylor has already decided she wants to be Jason, which is great because I'm really good at him, and she knows it, and she's just. This is fine. No, I can't click there. What? <laughs> I hope you guys saw that. I tried to click and drag away, but no arrow was there, so I clicked on the country again, and then they moved from that country back to that country. Good stuff, guys. I'm getting a lot of symptoms, which is worrying me. Okay. Hey, there we go. So I can go through there, I, I think, and infect the apes on the way. I don't know if there is any apes in Iceland, but everything's worth a try. I'm pretty sure if we we can go through countries, I think. I think that's how it works. Because I tried doing that with Necroa before and found out that, that is not the case. Okay, we are in that country, so we're going to need to upgrade fisticuffs in order to defend ourselves. Death to you. Alright, so now they're going to know. Ape attacks cause panic in Ukraine. I apologize, I just wanted to destroy the lab. Shit. Cure has begun! Shitty shit. Okay, destroy destroy that lab. No, go away. Destroy that lab. Alright, let's put another one of these... Argentina. Alright, 
so let's let's uh, more DNA points from colonies and possibly soon ape apes cause terror in Ukraine the following numbers of concerning ape incidents in Ukraine the government has promised to pursue radical methods to control the apes assassins combo apparently I got an achievement for something that I've gotten a million times that's another thing that annoys me about this game I have so many achievements that I should have gotten, but I haven't. Like some of the zombie uh, combos when I've actually upgraded my zombies fully. Which I think is just funny. Okay, we're in Australia. Let's go to the Philippines. Let's go to the Caribbean. Let's go to... Oh, we're not in... We're not in Korea? No, we are in Korea. Let's go to Japan. All right, we're getting quite a lot of DNA points, which is good. Let's do human to ape. Gonna have to pause it. Human to ape contact. Making the disease spread between the level people. What is a level people, you ask? Well, of course you want to know. A level people is a people that is super love. Super love. Have you ever been up to someone and said, Mmm, I feel like super love. And they were like, What the fuck is wrong with you? And you're like, baby, you don't even know about super love. Continue rambling. I'm just going to keep touching these red bubbles until something nice happens to me. Let's go to Zealand now. Let's go to Guinea now. Alright, so we are doing pretty good. Cure is only at 3%. Kind of worries me. Uh... Extreme bio aerosol is going to cost me 32. I think we can get that pretty quickly. Next colony is going to cost me 82, which is quite expensive if you ask me. Alright, we have extreme bio aerosol. Uh, it doesn't look like any ports have shut yet, which is very helpful. Okay, so now they're starting to shut land borders. So I assume that means that some countries are going to be like, ah, ah, ah. So I'm going to need to upgrade that. Okay, we're good. I don't know what I was doing. <laughs> I paused it out of instinct for some reason. Uh, where are you? Where are you? Where are you? You're in Japan. Not anymore, you're not. So if I remember this correctly, the cure can't move very fast without those labs. I am terribly wrong. The cure is still moving. Alright, I'm going to need you and you. Because we are not moving very fast in Russia. Where is the plane? Where is that plane? Oh, it's 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 right in there. What is that? Ukraine. Get out, apes. Okay, so I think now would be a good time to move my apes only to colonies. Um, ape scouts communicate with local uh, location of ape colonies to other intelligent apes. Apes will migrate from further away. Okay. So, a lot of my apes are going to be moving together now. Uh, I think all of the apes in the Ukraine are dead. Sweet. Alright, let's grab ape scouts. What's this? Pathfinders. Ape pathfinders help intelligent apes locate and travel to ape colonies. Apes will migrate from further away. Okay. Yes. Now, affect Canada. Oh, there was a Gensis lab in, in New Zealand? I didn't even know that. You're not killing my apes. Where did the lab go? Alright. So we've almost fully infected all the humans. Cure is still pretty much going for me. Canada seems like the biggest problem at the moment. Let's move this colony. We are... I think starting to kill people quite rapidly. Something dropped the cure. I don't know what it was. I think maybe destroying the lab did that actually. Alright, so I could probably grab another colony. But let's let's do what's this? Virus able to enter brain cells and modify DNA, improving existing neural pathways, increases intelligence in humans. I think the last of this kills them outright if I remember correctly. So, we just got another achievement, Discovery Channel combo. 
It's so annoying because I've seen these pop-ups before and they're like, no you haven't. Don't be silly. <laughs> You're full of crap. Alright, so let's upgrade this, 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 and this. Okay, what's this? Total brain death. Compre uh, comprehensive replacement of brain cell DNA triggers massive immune response leading to complete and irreversible loss of brain function. Have I completely infected the world? I have not. Where am I missing? It's probably prerequisite is to have the world. Where are the where are the healthy people? Canada. Canada. You bastards. Get sick. <laughs> Get sick. Just upgrade all the transmissions. Screw it. Get sick, damn you. <laughs> Cough on them. Oh, don't you dare die out. Don't you dare die out. Alright, let's just grab more more of these. <laughs> oh, if they die out, I'm going to be very, very upset. They might actually die out. Holy shit. Holy shit. 156 DNA points. Oh, I'm paused. I was like, why is nothing happening? I still have apes, though. So I guess I'm still fine. Barry creates Planet of the Apes. Oh, okay. That's right, we just need to wipe out a certain amount of humans. Anyway, Barry has created Planet of the Apes. Um, so, yeah, I'm glad we had a talk for like the first five minutes and then I proceeded to fall deep into the game. Um, I don't know what else to do with- holy shit, I got five, five biohazard symbols. Um, <laughs> my train of thought just derails every time I open my mouth. Um, I don't know what else to do with Plaguing. Uh, if you guys have any suggestions or anything you really would like to see. Uh, I could try multiplayer again, but I am really bad at it. Um, it's just the way that I play the game, but I don't think I'm very good. Ah, uh, yeah. Uh, a lot of you in the survey suggested that I should play more Plaguing. So I'm, I'd be curious to see what you, you guys have to say. Um, so yeah, I like thank you all very much for watching. I could even go back to just playing the game like this, I'm just chatting. <laughs> I'd like to thank you all very much for watching, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please don't forget to hit that like button. Let me know in the comment section below any of your thoughts. And I hope you all have a fantastic day. Bye.